Hey guys, it's Space Sims, and we are back with more of The Sims 4 Falling Stars, which is our star sign solar system legacy challenge. Couldn't do that all in one breath because, you know. Anyway, um, let's see. Right, everyone is hanging out, came for a visit, because Ashton invited himself around, which was cool. And I totally forgot he's going to bring the whole damn family. So Bree and Junior and Paris, right, yeah, Paris, wherever the hell Paris is. I don't remember if Paris was a boy or a girl. I have no idea. I don't remember. I have no, where the hell did the, Bree, where is your child? Yoshi, where are you? Oh, cue the punchline. Taco and Bree just can't stop cracking each other up. It's always a hoot when these two are in the same room. Family members with the jokesters, family dynamic will choose to perform funnier mischief interactions more often with each other. Feel extra playful. Yes, Taco and Bree can have that. That's cute. Where are you? Oh, there's the child. I think Paris was their son because like, Sure. We can. Okay, Junior. That's great. Wow, it's very loud in here. Anyway, I saw phone. Um. Oh yeah, no. Who's calling Kyoshi? Kyoshi, who's calling you? Land grab power. Due to squirrels, we're gonna turn off your power. Are you prepared? Prepared? What the fuck? Well, too bad. We're turning off your power right now. Actually, I hope you're stocked up on books and candles. Have a nice day. Son of a fucking bitch. Now, oh my god. You know what though? I love. The fact that they've turned off our power. Oh my god. That means we can't fucking eat food. We're not going to be able to cook. You can still cook. I guess because it's off the grid or whatever. Um, Aren't you glad you microwave? Well, it's too bad, kiddo. He is going to lose his mind. You can't play games. What are you going to do? I hope your phone is charged. Do you think I have a, I have a crush on... Z yeah, sure. Go for it, buddy. Anyway, our children aged up, so let's go into Cass. Um, so London and Rio aged up in the last part, and then they decided to, Ashton decided to call and bring the whole family over when we had just gotten rid of all of the toddler shit. And now there's a toddler in the house. There's still stuff for him to do. It's fine. But anyway, we gave her the playtime captain. Um, which is to seek out active play with friends and she's adventurous. That's nothing new. All right. So here we go. There's our little London. She kind of also looks like Kyoshi. Kyoshi's jeans are very prominent. She does have Taco's eyes and she has Grandpa Ashton's red hair. Which I kind of love. Um, we gave her some of the new clothes. I put new clothes on them from the new pack because I wanted to use it. But can I just be honest with you? What the hell low quit low quality shit is this necklace? Like it is basically like completely flat. It's supposed to look like beads, but it's like it is kind of awful. Did you let an intern do this? Did you let a 12-year-old do this? This would be like I mean, I'm not 100% sure I could make this if I tried, but I think that I could manage something this flat. That's kind of fucking bullshit at this point. This is what I expect from base game. I expect some actual fucking depth and dimension. There's no excuse for that at this fucking point. Like, none. None. Okay, that is... I mean, the bracelet is 3D. And that necklace is the most low-quality fucking thing I think I've ever seen in my life. Holy shit. I put it on her anyway, because it's cute. But I was like, this is kind of shit. What the hell? Look, look, we were getting to the point where everything was getting so much nicer. The texture. I mean, like, look at even just the shading and the textures on the jeans. Those are cute. Yeah. Okay. The buckles aren't real. They're one dimensional. We're used to that. I, I mean, actually, now that I notice it, I'm like, really, though? I mean, yeah. Okay. Uh, but the necklace, there's really no excuse for that. Like, I don't know. But anyway, I think they only have one outfit each. Yeah. Okay. Um... This dress obviously isn't from the new pack. There wasn't anything really for formal wear, but it's still super cute. She's got little owl earrings, you know, because there's owl shit in the pack. Um, just her little athletic wear. 
I'm getting really tired of athleisure fucking shit in all of our packs. I'm tired of baggy fucking jeans, athleisure wear, and square fucking boxy t-shirts. And, you know, since I play with male sims, that's basically all we get. And it kind of pisses me off. But for athletic outfits, fine. But we have enough things to choose from for athletic outfits. We don't need any more. Please stop. My sims don't exercise that much. Uh, her PJs obviously aren't from the pack because I didn't have any but that's okay her party wear uh, I kind of fucking love this little dress it's got a fucking owl on it so you know and a little bracelet because I just figured that like you know maybe she made it so she's always wearing it so there you go um and then her swimwear we got her hot weather outfit this little top is so fucking cute like I mean I love all the prints and shit I love this one too but like they're so cute I mean this one just says birds are playing but like it's fucking adorable you know, um, so there's that. And then her cold weather outfit it was just, this was from a different pack, but like, whatever. I like the neon colors and it was cute. So there you go. That's London. And then we have Rio who aged up with white hair. And I was like, I, he actually aged up with his hair. And I'm like, I'm just going to leave it. He looks like super adorable. Look at this little bas bastard, right? Um, so that little new shirt from the pack, which I think is really super cute. I like that. And then just regular jeans sneaks so there you go um his formal wear again not from the pack but athletic i don't think is either no that's from like maybe that kid kit which again is all like athleisure wear for kids because the kids never put on their athletic outfits if they go outside and play they're never wearing this i'm not sure why kids have athletic outfits i really am not sure because they don't it's like they were like infants don't have swimwear because you're not putting your infant in the pool or even the baby pool. That's for toddlers. But like kids, they were like, yeah, they have everything despite the fact that they're never going to wear this. Ever. I do wish when they went outside to play that they would put these on. You know what I mean? But I don't like them enough to put them as every day because I hate athleisure as every day where like, I, look, I run around the house in lounge pants and shit. Sure, fine. But like my Sims just need to do better. I don't like it. I'm not like, yes, let's put on our low yoga pants. No, please, God, don't. Stop. I mean, it's fine for real people, but not for Sims. Like, no. I just, I can't. I can't do that. I don't know. I don't It just bothers me, okay? <laughs> anyway, his PJs. His party outfit that we were also never see, because I don't think they ever changed party wear, even if we throw parties, but whatever. His swimwear. He got his hot weather outfit. He's got a matching bracelet with his sister. Maybe they made them together. I don't know. I really do love this fucking shirt too. I love the little star ones. There's the only thing. Okay. I want to love this with the elephant, but it seems a little more toddler-esque to me than child. It's a little too cute. And I don't know. I mean, yeah, you think about it. Like there's some little kids that are kind of in between toddler and like, 10 12 like kind of thing where these kids are but like for me it's just too, i'm like ugh, i love it but i feel like it's more toddler to me with the cute elephant than it is kid i don't know i don't know maybe i'm crazy but i do love the star ones and i love the little freaking stripey sleeves and like so that's kind of why i love this one too i love the rainbow but i wanted the star one and i like how that one has the contrasty stripey sleeves and then is winter wear because i just fucking love that and that is actually tagged as for girls only and that's stupid because it's a freaking cute jacket so why can't boys wear it it's dumb. they do dumb things i'm just in a bad mood right now because like seriously it took my sim six hours to get his infant into the house six sim hours obviously and that has just lowered my tolerance for all sorts of bullshit and my bird's going to start screaming downstairs and I'm going to yeet my computer. <laughs> I really should have taken a break, but I would never have come back. Uh, I'm sorry. I am in a foul mood and this is just not like conducive to recording, but we got to do it because I don't have any other chance to. It'll be okay. It's fine. But then the goddamn land grab power company decided to turn my power off and I have four house guests. And my nerd son is going to lose his shit because he can't play on the computer. This is a nightmare. I kind of Oh, look at that. Now our power's back on. 
our strong friendship has me thinking how we should live together. Can I move in? I don't think that's a good idea. Um. Anyway, everyone loves attending social events that Kiyoshi hosts. Kiyoshi has a great reputation. After much deliberation, Indiana doesn't want Junior to move in with him right now. Wait, you asked my teenage son? I thought for sure he asked Taco. So Junior was like, Taco, I want to be besties. And then went to his teenage son and was like, we should move in together. Junior, is life that really shitty at your house? At freaking Ashton's goddamn house. Enthused about video games. Hey, I got a special gift for you because we're such a good neighbor. Who is this? What is happening? Why is this? Why is this? Who is this? Who is Arturo and why is he at my house? That's fine, I guess. We'll invite you in. Sure. And then go get something to eat. Holy hell. I do love the fact that he his favorite outfit. Is this one? Like, I know we put his party wears, all of his other cosplays and stuff. I do want more than five outfits. You know what I mean? Or if we could, I really do. I will be wishing till the end of time that they gave us the ability to, like, save outfits. You know what I mean? Um, Because I would save this. I would save his other cosplay ones. And then this way I could just be like, put him in this cool and then switch them around you know why is arturo giving me a gift indy what are you doing what did he give you he gave me a twinbrook postcard are you my like pen pal i guess i'm gonna give you a friendly introduction but okay i got the twinbrook postcard Cool. He just came here and gave me a postcard. Hi. Can we... Nothing's been delivered. Did... But the thing is, is we wrote and we made pen pals and there's no, like, we got no pen pal things. Oh, you know what? We can just slap these toys out. Here's one for you. We'll put this one here. We will put this one on your desk. And then you've got one like here too. So there you go. Some toys. Oh shit. There's other ones. Okay. Well, we don't need all of these. These ones are like, okay. We already put four of them out. That's enough. We can get rid of some of the other ones. <gasps> oh, wait, that's my child's other postcard. We did get one. You went and got in the mail. Oh, we have two postcards. Look at that. Who's in here? Oh, right. Shit. Okay, we'll do that tomorrow on Wednesday or tomorrow afternoon. Okay. I did put down a cemetery. I totally forgot. Um. Okay. So it's not, I don't want to say a real cemetery. Um, it is a real cemetery. I put, I found a couple that I liked. I put it down in Magnolia Promenade because we never go there. Uh, because there's retail lots, but now because this save file is someone else's save file that they created, I never thought about it. Like perhaps, perchance, they did their due diligence and went into the like they and made sure that things were actually purchasable. Curse you, land grab power! It's okay. We have power back now because I went into cast, so that was awesome. So you go go get something to eat, sweetie. Shout forbidden words. Kiyoshi, it's okay. Could you go get something to eat? Kiyoshi, what is wrong with you? Kiyoshi, what the hell is actually wrong with you? Kiyoshi. More choices. Open. Oh, there's only cakes. Okay. Well, we don't have any food. You can eat this. Yoshi, eat that eggs and toast. And our power's back on, so you could also cook something? We could serve dinner. Let's serve fried chicken sliders. How about, why is Kyoshi not doing any? Okay. I was like, why is Kyoshi refusing to do everything I tell him to do? Kyoshi, are you trying to test the limits of my patience? Because the other you in another game also tested the limits of my patience by being a butt face. 
Yeah, you are... Okay, finally. You're testing my limits. Kyoshi's also the baby daddy. Why are you tense? I hate cooking. You hate cooking? Oh. Do you really? Huh. Go fig. Uh, sure. All right, well. I'll have you go pee when you're done. I didn't realize you hated cooking! So Taco is supposed to be the one to- You don't even have a job, Kyoshi! Yes, you do. Never mind. I'm sorry, Kyoshi. I'm sorry, Kyoshi. It's not fair of me to, like, be like that with you. <laughs> I'm sorry, sweetie. I was just like, Kyoshi, you don't work. So what are you doing? No, go to bed. Leave the toddler alone. Kyoshi, what the actual fuck? Kyoshi. Jokesters! Ryo and Taco are jokesters. Sure, we already read that, so that's cool. This is the love side of that. I just don't want to ask. Okay, go to sleep. The toddler alone. The toddler's fine. She's exhausted. Why is everyone... You were just talking to people, so I'm not dealing with this, like... Okay, go to bed when you're done, Taco. Ah, oh, poor Taco. Okay, our guests can stay up because I want beds for them and they can sleep on couches. It's fine. But we could also have asked them to, like, oh, at least we get to super speed. Where's Junior? Where's the baby going? Maybe you should watch your kid. Oh my god, the toddler just left. The baby just fucking peaced out. Did you see that? Well, uh, Paris was like, peace, and just vanished. Where did he go? Where did he go? Is he coming back? <laughs> oh, that's your brother. Have you pee? I'm gonna have you use your own. Take a bubble bath. Use your own bathtub. I think you just need to be able to get on this side. I think it's fine if you can't get there. Like, you always go to the other one, but, like, I wish you could assign and be, like, assigned to, like, this is his bathroom. Like, use this one. I know you're grungy, sweetie. And then we'll go grab something to eat. Take a bath. All right, fine. I guess you can't use that bathtub. Which is weird, because that's floating above it. It's not even in the bathtub. You might not be able to get to it because of the curtain or the raw or something stupid, but, like, whatever. It's fine. The bathtub looks nice. I don't feel like trying to figure out what it is. Also, I never noticed that that was floating above it. <laughs> like, whatever. It should be fine there. Um... And that's why, like, all that stuff was just on the one side. So I'm not really sure. I didn't see what he was. Oh, okay. Now you're back. You're back from your wander around. Okay. Good job. Okay. It's Wednesday at 5 a.m. We have to go. You have school. Could we? I might send you alone. This way we can go. To uh, oh, your homework is so not done. You need to do your homework. Um, where's just do homework? Do homework. Do your homework. Oh, you have so many of these in your inventory that we can get rid of. We don't need all these. We have like eight thousand. I we also don't need all these like projects. I'm not gonna do them. All right. And, oh, whoops. Are you done with your homework? School starts in an hour. Okay, cool. Everybody's getting a little glitchy and janky right now, so. Are you done with your homework? Because you seem like you're done with your homework, but you're also not done with your homework. But anyway, did you do your homework? Can you, like, clean that up? Child, you did not do your homework, but it's too late. I don't particularly... Look, I'm not too concerned if they're terrible. You are gonna... I'm gonna send you alone this way. We can take Taco, Yoshi, Ashton to the graveyard. Um. Oh, wait, you have to go to work and shit. Never mind. I'll, we'll just do it after everybody gets home. 
you still have to get your robotic skill up. You have to construct mechanisms and you got to do all of your, okay. To be fair, he doesn't have to do his aspiration. We're basically good on taco. I will, I'll join you at school. There's no point. Whatever. Everybody, like I forgot everybody else has to go to work. Adults have to go to work. You know, it's just because it's Saturday and my brain is like, nope, work. I took work and I shoved it in the dark recesses of my brain and I forgot it existed for a minute. That was nice. Now I remember I have a job and I don't like it anymore. I do like my job. I mean, I don't like love my job. It's not like it's my dream job, but I really do like where I work, honestly. Um, I think it's a good place to work. I do. I'm not going to talk about it specifically, like where I work, because what I do online here and my work are different. And I'm not crossing that line where it's like, I work at XYZ and then XYZ doesn't like that. I swear in my videos and then fires me. You know what I mean? Like there's places I work at places that are douchey enough to do that. Um, but also people just have this weird thing that like, Oh, I'm watching this YouTube video and I don't like you and you work for this company. So that I'm going to, you know what I mean? Like people are stupid. Like what I do outside of work, does not reflect, should not reflect on my company. You know what I mean? If I'm at work telling people to go fuck themselves on like phone calls and shit, like, yeah, legit. Okay, then yeah, that reflects on my company, but I'm here, so that's my own business. You know what I mean? I also don't put where I work on any of my social media, but I do like where I work. I do think it's a good company to work for. It's a very big fucking company, you know. You should go do that workout thing, but I'm going to have you do your extra credit because you're a nerd. And I don't like that the game is like, work out. I don't think he would. I guess we can try it. I just hate it. Huh? Womberg, Womberg. He said Womberg, but it sounded like he said Hallmark, Hallmark. Ha, ha, ha. Like, what a weirdo. Chat with other students. Clean the whiteboard. Um, you know what? Instead of doing this, I'm just going to mark that off because I hate that it forces me to do this. Let's come here. No, prank it. I want to clean it. How come I can't clean it? How come I can't clean it? It says clean the whiteboard, but I can't. Play video games. Yeah, attend class. Click on a used whiteboard. I mean, this is fucking used. Why can I only prank it? That pisses me off. It's like, it can only be on a used whiteboard. Do you not see all the freaking shit all over that whiteboard? So annoying. Oh, okay. We have to study high school. Study for exams. Hold on. You, I'm going to have you go to work. Yoshi's already at work. Everybody else is at school. Let's have you two make friends. What? Okay, your free time's gonna end soon. Look at that. Your notebook, your school notebook for studying is mint colored like your dad's color. Okay, stop studying and go to class. Put it away. Oh, also, can you change your outfit? Because you've been wearing this for a while. He just really likes this outfit. I'm not gonna lie. He changed into it. Let's change into your every... Well, you only have three outfits, though, to be fair. I just kind of figured that there was going to be an opportunity to, like, give him more outfits later. Um, and maybe we'll change his cosplay stuff later on, but. I just love seeing him walk around in that. It's ridiculous because it's like, this is my sim. And everyone's like, wait, what? And then it's like, no, but look at him. He's adorable. He's such an adorable little nerd. I love him so much. Acquire the acting and painting skills. Good for us. It's cool. You know, having a little bit of acting skills so we can, like, act like the characters we're cosplaying, right? Be friendly with a faculty member. Oh, well. Can you, like, do friendly introduction to your teacher? You can't. He just drew all over it. Why can't I clean it? School, study for exams. 
Are you hungry or anything? You're not, you're fine. It's, but it's clean. It's dirty. He just wrote all over it. Why can't I clean the whiteboard? My Zim just wants to clean the whiteboard like the little nerd he is. Why won't you let him? Will you put that away? Why are you not studying for exams like I told you to? High school, study for exams. I told you to study for exams and you took out your book and then you like, and now it's a different color book. And now there's one in here. Can I sell that? I can't. Huh. Anyway. All right. Well, that's good. You can put that away. Go do something else. Are you, oh my God. What am I doing? Are you hungry? You're really not. Why don't you go pee though? He's like, study. Entering a phase. Oh dear God. What phase? What phase? Oh no. Come on. London met Trey while at school. <laughs> oh, that was Trey. Okay. I was like, well, that didn't look like my child. Picky eater. London met Jackson at school. I saw this picture and I was like, wait, what? Who the hell is that kid? Right. That's Trey. All right, little bitch. Go get something to eat. Never mind. You don't have time. Go to class. <gasps> oh no, who died? Who died? Why can't I answer my phone? Oh no. Kiyoshi, that was your dad, wasn't it? Oh, sweetie. You have to go to class. I'm sorry. You weren't really close with him. I was like, if it's Ashton, I'm going to be so mad he's at my house. Aww, I know. And now you're hungry. Aww. I know. We're late to class. And if the teacher yells at you, I'm going to be like, my grandfather just died. I got a call in the middle of my school day. I'm hungry and I'm sad. Poor thing. Oh, look at him. Oh, look at his little face. <laughs> look at his little face. I love their sad little puppet faces. They do. They are kind of puppety, aren't they? The Sims. I like them, though. <laughs> like, ah, You're attending class. Why isn't that giving you credit? Because he only decided to take notes now. His life is hard. Girl, you need to, like, pee and eat. What the hell? Can you, like, why is school, like, not letting you eat? Okay, can you, like, take care of self? Care for self. Care for self. Okay, you're caring for self. You need to also care for self. Okay, you were also caring for... Okay, you're doing good. I know, baby. Oh, Kiyoshi seems pretty fine. He seems kind of... You did not have the... Did you even have a relationship with Naoki aside from, like, knowing that he was your grandfather? Like... Oh, look at that! Our principal's dead! Oh, yeah, I mean, you had an okay relationship. Alright. Wait, do you have a... Life. Childhood phase. Picky eater. Are you serious? Are you serious? There is no, like, there would be, like, be born, blah, blah, blah. There is a picky eater phase, but there's no, like, someone died? There's no, he's only milestone he has ever achieved in his whole life. Granted, the milestones came and he was already a teenager, so whatever. But the only one is picky eater. That's it. Not loss of a family member. They have births. Like, when your sim is a baby and is, like, had a baby or a baby joined the family, but there's not, like, someone died? That's not a milestone? That's a milestone. Oh, your activity starts in 24 hours. Okay. Why don't you... 
do your homework because you have to do your homework a couple of times. And then we'll go. You're fine. You're an A student. Good for you. You had to get programming. So we'll practice programming once your homework's done. I'll let you go home after that. Um, I love the fact that you're an A student. Of course you are. Take after your dad. We won't talk about that B he got in college because I think that was rigged. I think that same professor. I think that professor absolutely knew Colorado. It might have been the same professor Colorado had. Can you imagine that? Like Colorado's grandson goes to college and has this old professor who's like, I remember your grandfather, B. I'm just saying. Because I'm pretty sure that was actually that went have been in his like mechanical engineering class, which, you know, I don't think Taco really enjoys the life we've set up for. <laughs> Poor Taco. That's why he got chubby. He eats his feelings. I feel that girl. I do. I really do. You're like, I am mad, let me eat. I am sad, let me eat. I'm bored, let me eat. Yeah, no, I get it. Taco, you me same. That's why we're both chubby. Oh. We're taco. <laughs> Ugh. He did not get the fast metabolism like Kyoshi. Although Kyoshi, for having a fast metabolism, you know, just because of his old age, he's getting a little thick. He's not like his skinny little rabbit self like he used to be. Which is fine, because, you know, we all get a little chubbier as we get older. Who is that? I don't know you, so what do I need to do? Oh, programming. Let's come up here. Can we get the mail yet? Nothing. I'm going to have you come up to your room. Whoops, this is too far up. Um, I am going to have you, more choices, socialize, um, check for pen pal replies, and can we ask for a postcard? We have Lucky Palms and Lunar Lakes. Let's just do that, right? Because that's Lucky, Lunar Lakes. Oh, we don't have Lucky Palms. We have Twinbrook, though, because we got that as a gift. Ask for postcard from... What did I say? Shit. Which one did I say it was? I have a new pen pal from Sunset Valley. We need Sunset Valley and Lucky Palms. Why can't I ask... Oh, still awaiting a reply from this pen pal. Oh, but we already have... Okay, that's weird. More choices. Socialize. Write a letter to Sunset Valley. Oh, because I just sent... Okay, never mind. That's why. I just sent them a thing. That was stupid. Okay. Chat with... We... Allison and I do not like each other. Christopher Bowers and I have good compatibility. Who is he, though? Do we know him? Is he a teenager? Where's Christopher? I don't think we know him. We don't even know him! I don't know. Well, like, whatever. We can chat. Oh, here's Christopher. Oh, he's a teen. Okay, cool. Good compatibility. We can make friends. Uh, more choices. Practice programming. Taco can't help. Oh, Taco's having fear of a dead-end job. Do you want to quit your job? Do you want to get a promotion? Well... Paco, you're gonna need to, like, not eat your feelings, girl. You know what I do love about The Sims? All your clothes grow with you. Look at you. You do look like you swallow a basketball. Like, Yoshi's gotten a little bit thicker. Like, Yoshi ain't as skinny as he used to be. But, like, you know, I think he's carrying it a little bit better than poor Taco. But again, Taco, I feel you. Because I don't carry it well either, girlfriend. You want to reach level two of the charisma skill. I don't think day drinking is how you're going to... Oh, it's 6 p.m., so it's fine. Um, why don't you go practice some speech? I did not actually check on that. Give yourself a pep talk. Practice your speech. Get maybe some charisma. You know what? Actually, Kiyoshi, I'm sorry. I understand why you're drinking. I do. Sometimes you just need a motherfucking drink. I'm going to have you drink that when you're done. Indiana's doing okay. What's this? Grandparent love from a grandparent staying over. Oh, right. We were going to go 
It's 6 p.m. Let's actually hold on. Travel. Um, I like when you do household, it brings everybody. We'll leave Paris. I don't want to deal with the top. Actually, you know what? Oh, we can't. Oh, we can't because we can only travel with seven sims. That's fine. We'll leave Paris. Paris is fine. Paris doesn't need to be here. Okay, we're going to do this. Okay, stop doing that. I need to travel. I kind of forgot. I know you're tired. It's okay. We need to go see our cemetery and put Colorado and Shiraishi down. So I put it in Magnolia Promenade. So there's actually retail lots here. And I always put use this as the retail center. But then I don't actually ever go in and make sure things are for sale. So then you go there and it's stupid and it's pointless. I've never been here because I always forget that, like, this isn't my save file. You know what I mean? So I don't know. They may have gone in and made sure things were for sale or when people uploaded the like retail lots, if they set things for sale, then when you download it, it works. But if they don't set things for sale, they just put things out. You have to have a sim to own that and then do it. So there was one here originally. I like bulldozed it, replaced it with the cemetery because I was like, at least this way we come here. Um, and because I was like, I never use any of these damn retail lots. And then I went, oh, this isn't even my save file. So like they might have actually gone through and this sim owns this and did that because they put a lot of backstory into the families and like whatever. So I can't remember whose save this was because I have two different save files that are not mine that I started using. Um, what's the other one in there? Anyway, um, so this, as you saw, was the Glimmerbrook Cemetery. Oh, great. It's always going to have these freaking flags up. Son of a bitch. Anyway, um, so everything about it was like really like red and beautiful. I kind of liked that. I just like the color. This was originally set up over here. There was like a casket and there was like, like so like set up for like a funeral. But I kind of got rid of that. Um, this was also supposed to be for pets. But I figured this can be like our, our spares. And I want to see. Oh, here we go. In memory of... Albert. Yes. And then this I want to be in memory of Archer. So now this is Albert and that's Archer. Cool. These tombstones are, are um, ravishing. They look just like the regular tombstones, but they have that like... Actually, I'm going to have you come here and strengthen connection to physical world so that you can tether a ghost to these. Because remember, we went around and we couldn't find Albert's tombstone, right? We're like, where the fuck is out? We couldn't find him. Now we have him tethered to this. So that was Ravishing doing, like, creating these tombstones so that you can do that. And I mean, Archer may have been around, whatever. So we will try to find everyone that we can. We're not going to worry about, honestly, um, like, I mean, do you see how big Colorado's motherfucking family is? Holy shit, we're not getting that far out. But, like, eventually, if we can get, like, Dakota and Arizona, I'll put them in there. I'm not worried about all of their kids or their spouses. But they are Colorado's children, so I do want to find them or put them in here. Now we come down here to Ashton. So Ashton obviously had kids with Albert, so we put Albert in there because he's the father now i don't care about destiny or whatever i will try to get brie baby junior whatever but if something happens with pair whatever you know what i mean we're kind of keeping our direct line this is where we are going to put our main family so this was supposed to be set up for individuals but i'm going to put two of them together so we are going to put colorado and shiraishi here together and then what we'll do is Ashton will probably be on his own, right? Indiana will be here. Indiana's spouse is supposed to cheat on him and then they get divorced, whatever. But that's going to be his kid's other parent. So he will go here with the person he ends up married to because that's like, Shiraishi is not, well, Shiraishi is some of, like, we don't actually have, like, for Archer, unfortunately, I mean, for Ashton, we don't have, Reggie, 
Oh my god, we need another one of those things. I forgot about poor Reiji. Wait. Okay, hold on a second. Let me go in here because I want to move this for a hot second. I want to move these over because we're going to put them kind of together so that they're like, you know. You know, whatever. Or not there too, whatever. And I want to see if I can now use this. Now it's now, oh, now it's now a standard tombstone. Oh, no, it is. Okay, so Ravishing has this one. She also has the furry friend headstone for pets or whatever. But this is like, actually, this one only has this color. So I'm going to put this here because I just thought about that. We do want to have Reiji in here. So he will be here. And what I might also do, hold on a second. Let's see. Why is my venue incomplete? It's generic. Hold on, what? Wait a minute. Why is this? Why is my, it's not a community space. What the fuck? It's not a community space though. It's a generic lot. Why are you doing that? I don't have sub venues. I had one that was a community lot, but I changed it and I put this one down as like, yeah, put it as a park. Or it was supposed to be a community lot and I said it. Like, I want to see though. I don't know if we can put, oh, we can. Yes, everyone you know. Where's, there's Arch. Oh my God, did Reggie already get cold? Oh shit. He might have, you knew him, right? Oh, fuck. All right. I might have to come back here as Ashton. Uh, because I don't want to. MC Command Center, can I control for a hot? Uh, I will have to go in and control him. And see if I can get him over here to put Reiji down. But that's... Anyway. What I also wanted to do, which I feel like you might have in your inventory. Um, because this was set up with like all these little pictures and I left one here to think about. Because I want to put down... I feel like we should have a photo. We do not. Son of a bitch. Where did they go? We don't have any photos of yes we do okay you have them for some reason that's cool it's either that one or this one actually you know what that one's cute let's keep this one okay hold on oh wait i should have added the never mind oh my god so i want to put the photo up here so that we know who they are so okay now my game's frozen son of a bitch ah oh, frick been doing this a lot lately where it's freezing on the weirdest shit and then I can't. Why? Come on, game. What the fuck? I can't lose 40 minutes of time. Oh, good fucking God. And then build mode still doesn't want to load properly. It's half loaded. That's fine, I guess. I don't even know if this is recording because everything's frozen, so. Okay. Can we. Can we, can you, this is like the old days of build mode where it would like do this, but okay, never mind. Well, one of these days we'll get in here. Okay, thank you. I also do want to kind of move these again. Um. Oh, and the fact that this was, aha, we get that right in the center. And then they're touching it, and it's okay. Okay, now we can get rid of this one. I wanted to leave it so that I would remember that I want to put the picture here. I guess we have to move it up. Okay. I hate the fact that these things don't go away now. Like, if you kind of do this, like, the thing doesn't... They used to go away. You know what I mean? Like, you used to be able to hide that panel, and it doesn't go away now, and it's so annoying. I don't like it. Whoever made the choice... I mean, that was a choice, and it was a stupid one. I also now, if, oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. 
can't handle this right now. I can't handle my game being like this. I just like go away. Just just whatever. Okay, so we're going to have to move this up. And with my luck, it'll Are you serious? Why can't I just rotate my photo? Why is my alt not working? Why is alt not fucking working on my photo? Okay. Hold on. This is annoying as shit. Oh, for fuck's sake. This shouldn't be this fucking complicated! Like, it should not be this motherfucking complicated. Okay. Now, I'm gonna just put this in my inventory for a hot second. And then I'm going to take it out and see if I can, like, put it on the ground. Okay, you can't rotate them from live mode, but live mode, whatever. Oh my god. I should be able to rotate this. It's on the ground. I just want it slightly angled. I don't want it totally straight on. That's fucking weird. Oh my god. Game is testing my fucking patience today, and I just... I want to cry right now. Like, this is stressing me out so beyond imaginable. Like, it shouldn't be this complicated or this stressful to just go in and move a photo but no build mode has to be like no but and i can't uh, and it's just being so fucking janky right now and it hasn't been this janky in like years we used to have this problem a lot and like now i don't i don't fucking understand sweet goddamn jesus Will you please? I can't rotate my fucking photo. It's just gonna have to go totally motherfucking straight. Which is gonna look dumb as shit. But that's fine. Because we can't rotate it. Because I can't just slightly angle it. Which I should be able to fucking do. Oh my god. Fuck my life. I can't. Taco likes gossip. Sure, I don't care, Taco. For god's sakes. Can we all just go home now? Anyway... That's our freaking thing. I hope they're fine. Okay, everyone's fine. We'll make a freaking day of mourning kind of thing, or we'll just come here every time we need a person. But anyway, also while they're leaving and my frame rates are janky, this is where we're gonna put the spares. So we'll put like Brie over here with Junior, and then we'll like if we get Paris, we'll like make Paris's tombstone smaller and we'll just kind of put them here. Um, so this will be our spare kind of thing. And this side was basically a mimic of this side. I moved things over and added another one. So we have our gen one, two, three, four, all, all the way through. Because by the time we end, can you all, are you going home? Dear God. Anyway, by the time we fill that up and the 10th generation is there, because technically this is a 12 gen legacy, right? We started on the third gen, which was our first gen. So for us, we're playing 10 out of the 12 because we, quote unquote, already had the two. Um, so what's going to happen is that graveyard, obviously, the first gen's already there. Ashton will be not long for this world to go in there. Um, and then we'll keep going. But... By the time we reach our 10th, which will be the game's actual 12th, right? We, the 10th gen might not be dead. So when we're done with this series, not all 12 gens are going to be in there. You know what I'm saying? So I didn't need to make space for first 12 gens. I didn't need 12 spots because the 12th gen will be alive. You know what I mean? And if for some reason the 11th gen dies suddenly or whatever and we're not, then we'll make room. But I'm not too concerned about it at this point. So anyway, you need to go pee and go to bed. Okay. Okay. Go home and then go pee. Go pee. And then go to bed. I know it's 9 p.m. You can go to bed. You can go do something fun and then grab something to eat. You took a nap. You're going to bed and you need to do something, but whatever. So you need to 
You need to do shit for work because you want to get a promotion and you're never. Okay. Well, anyway, maybe we'll have you work from home tomorrow so we can do all this shit for you. So anyway, you're eating cereal. I know that there's real food in this house somewhere. Maybe not because our guests and you. Oh, that's true. Friendly. More choices. Ask Ashton to help out. I will ask everybody else to help out. Um, but then I'm going to let you go to bed. So, hey, could you help out, Gramps? Gramps, I'm going to need... No, leave the fucking toddler alone. You go the fuck to bed. Jesus fucking Christ. Leave the goddamn toddler alone. Who gives a fuck? Not your problem. Go to fucking bed. Let your goddamn relatives deal with their own damn child. What the fuck are you doing? No. You are not going to go play dolls. You can go grab something to eat and then you can go the fuck to sleep. Like, what the hell? Oh, dear God. Or just go to bed. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up here because they're all driving me crazy. How long until our goddamn family leaves? Holy shit. They're going to be here till Saturday. All right. Whatever. Anyway. Um... Yeah, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.